Hi Chris, happy... I know this one. Um, Wednesday. Teaching Tuesday on Wednesday. But it's also May 4th, so there's a lot of Star Wars shit going around on the internet, because May the 4th be with you. So that's mm -hmm. funny. Um, I was trying to come up with something to teach you for Teaching Tuesday, like how to play the ukulele, but you're lefty, or how to juggle, but you're clumsy. Um, or how to dance, but you don't have rhythm, and I don't know how to dance. So I thought something that I already know fairly well, and I will tell you why Cinderella wears glass slippers. But first... So when the Brothers Grimm were collecting their fairy tales, they weren't really trying to collect fairy tales because they were also German nationalists and college professors. So they and their graduate students went out and tried to collect just all of the oral folklore because they were trying to show that the uh, Germanic peoples had a, a rich tradition stretching back into antiquity. Because um, this is technically before, Ger there wasn't really Germany, there were just Germanic peoples, the unification of Germany was much later. But one of the things that they found was the, the story of Cinderella. Um, I'm going to stop for a second here and assume that you know the story of Cinderella. So this is the part where I don't reiterate it. Uh, they found the story of Cinderella and, and integrated that into the Grimm's fairy tales, not realizing that it was actually... They were, they were being retold the story of Saint-Lyon by Charles Perrault from a century prior. And in Saint-Lyon, uh, she wears souillet du verre. And in French, souillet are, are slippers and ver, V-A-I-R, it's the same word in English, it's a type of, of squirrel fur, basically, ver. Um, but there's, ver uh, is not a word in German, but a lot of German people sort of spoke French, and so since this was orally transmitted, though, uh, they heard souillet du ver, as in the French un ver du lait, V-E-R-R-E, -E, uh, meaning like a, a glass of something, like a glass of water or a glass of milk. And so, uh, as a souillet de verre became verre, as in verre du lait, uh, like a glass. And that is why Cinderella wears glass slippers. <laughs> uh, as a side note, it was also originally called Cendrillon et les Sur Cannibales, Cinderella and the Cannibal Sisters, in case you ever wondered where her father was during the whole debacle. He was eaten to death. <laughs>